Ciao Tesla people, uh, today we'll do the supercharge talk uh, uh, number 24, but first I need to charge, so let's get out, actually let me open the charge port, open charge port, okay let's see if uh, everything goes well, uh, number, let's try this guy, Hopefully it's this guy. Yep, fortunately. Unfortunately, there is, there is no number in the app to identify the charge, the charger. Okay. 37%, yeah, correct. And it's charging, looks like. I'm curious to see how fast it's going to be because uh, I'm at 37%. Green. Great. Let's see how much I'm charging. 118, 128, 130. Okay, this charge is 150 maximum. So 130, start at 130, it's pretty good. So I'm going to charge to um, 90 or 95 because tomorrow I'm going to uh, leave for Florence and uh, it's a more than 400 kilometers strip, uh, mostly highway, uh, so it's going to be interesting. Um, as usual, I stop usually at Magliano Sabina, the supercharger, so it's right um, uh, midway, uh, halfway, and that's it. So let's do the supercharger talk number 24. There are lots of news uh, on the, in the Tesla world. Uh, let me put you down here. Okay, yeah, should be okay like this. Okay. So, the first thing that I wanted to mention is that the tariffs in, in Europe started and Tesla got a, a hike of prices by 9%. So, the tariffs uh, plus 9%. They were planning for 20 so 9% is a discount. I don't know. Depends on how you want to see it. So, uh, if, if uh, Tesla are coming from China and all Model 3 Highland come from China, um, I don't know if Model Y, no, I think they're all from Germany. Anyway, they, they cost 9% uh, more. Can do anything about it. Tariffs are tariffs. I'm against tariffs, so we'll see. Anyway, in, uh, at the Giga Berlin, uh, we spotted uh, uh, two semi truck from Tesla, so that means that they are testing uh, the semi here in Europe. Um, pretty good. Uh, someone spotted uh, in the highway was uh, on top of another truck. So we'll see how it goes. Uh, talking about the cyber truck, I got Tesla Vision finally. Uh, many people are happy and got FSD, which is. FSD? Yeah, I think so. Uh, I have to check again, but I think I think so. I saw some videos. Um, and then there were a new picture of the Model Y Juniper uh, in California. Uh, it was all wrapped uh, around covers, so I couldn't see much. But I guess they're testing it. And, um, you know, and it usually it's, it, it was uh, the same period of last uh, year of the Model 3. So it looks like that uh, Model Y Juniper might come out uh, early January, let's hope, in January, or, or the first quarter. Then there was a new uh, Model Y 7 uh, seat configuration in China, which is pretty interesting. Uh, not much details about that, and uh, I think it was uh, for next year. And then, uh, um, what else? Oh, okay, so sentry mode clips for Android. So if you have an Android uh, phone, like I have an Android phone, and uh, I, uh, iPhones, uh, iOS, uh, uh, they already had this feature. So if, uh, if you have sentry mode on and somebody tries to open the doors or anything else in a on a car, um, you'll receive a, 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 a video clip on your mobile phone, okay? which finally uh, came to Android. 
you won't get any every and any notification uh, a video clip because if someone passes in front of your car you might be an event on the sentry mode but you don't need to get a video clip so are for a particular situation uh, also here in Italy there was a three three uh, thousand euros discount uh, until the 30th of September for uh, the R RWD real-wheel drive uh, uh, Teslas so you have to buy it uh, uh, before uh, September 30th uh, the, so it's a big discount the only thing is if you finance the car the interest rates are pretty pretty high so you get a discount on one side you get uh, hike on the um, interest rate unfortunately now on the past uh, uh, Tesla update the 2024.26.7 there was a, a OTA recall for autopilot I mentioned in the in my video so check out the video for the all the details uh, and so there were three undocumented changes one was two were autopilot and, and the other one was uh, what was it? I already forgot it. Um, I forgot. Check out the video. <laughs> um, and then there, there are a bunch of uh, Tesla updates going around. There is the 2024.26.20, actually, .8, that, and has new features, .20 and .32. And there are new features there too. So we're waiting to see which one uh, comes first. In the meantime, I'm already at 49%. Please leave a like and subscribe to the channel. It will help me a lot. And then the last one I wanted to mention is that um, the referral program is back. Uh, so if you buy a Tesla, you get a $1,000 discount if you use a referral code from someone. And the people that get uh, the referral uh, get a $500 um, coupon to spend in the e-shop uh, tesla e-shop okay so this is come this is only in the us it came to canada and hopefully it will come to europe soon so stay tuned um so if you plan to buy a tesla use my referral one is going to be active okay it will help me uh, a lot and you get a one thousand dollar or maybe here it's one thousand euros discount too then on top of the 3,000 would be a great deal. Yeah, we'll see if, if it comes to Europe before the end of uh, September, it would be a great deal. Anyway, these are all the news that I wanted to give for the supercharger talk number 24. Now I need to, uh, I need to check my tire pressure because uh, they are at 39 PSI. 38 and 39 and 40 should be 42 okay so let's try to uh, fill some of these guys okay let me get in the back uh, my air pump fortunately I didn't park too close to this pole uh, so I have the air pump here what happened here old water shoot okay okay I don't know what happened uh, let me get the, the pump okay here's the pump let's go to pump some air do I have enough uh, juice here should be okay so where is the here's the the turn Okay, let's see how it goes. I'm at 38. 
we'll charge it to 40 and see how it goes uh, later on uh, because uh, sometimes they get warmer yeah 39 Unfortunately, I have low battery on the pump, so I need to maybe do it at home. We'll see how it goes. And then I have a video for tonight. I tried to wash again my car and uh, I failed uh, and the reason I failed let me check this guy is a 40 okay so if you see here there are a bunch of uh, this this raisin I park under a pine tree you see raisin and uh, the the soap that I used was supposed to remove it but it didn't remove at all you know, clean the car, but it didn't remove the resin, which I was, uh, I bought it uh, to do exactly that, and it didn't do it, so failed. Uh, if you have any suggestion, I know maybe hot water, or um, hot water and soap, or even alcohol, uh, maybe on the wind, I can try the alcohol on the window when I get home, and see if it works. So let's check here, 41. So let's stop at 41, and this is 40 pump, so I can maybe pump some air on the other side. Yeah. Actually, this one in the back, let me do this. Wow, very tight. Okay, you got it. And let me put you down here. Thirty-seven point five. Let's see how it goes. I put it on one at forty-one. It's supposed to be forty-two. So we'll see how it goes. In the meantime, this guy's charging, I'm at 60%, charging 81 kilowatts. I put a 19 kilowatts hour in it. That's good. I checked the, the app before, it was supposed to be someone here, but I came and there was nobody, which is good. It's still hot. And you see all the mountains, it's pretty nice, but the weather, it sucks. So let's check out the one chaser. Uh, 39. Uh, and here is a 62%, 80 kilowatts. Still there. This is only 150 kilowatts, so um, there are other ones that are 300 kilowatts, but I guess see here there is not much traffic. I wish there was a supercharger here, because uh, this valley, Sulmona, uh, is surrounded by national parks. So I went uh, the other time, I made a video about Pacentro and Mayela, that's the national park, Mayela National Park. Down there, you cannot see it behind the clouds, is Velino Mountain. And there is a national park behind these mountains here and down there there is the Abruzzo National Park one of the biggest the largest uh, in Italy and there are a bunch of uh, WWF uh, uh, sites in, in the meantime it's 40.5 I will stop at 41 so I wish uh, there was a supercharger here uh, people don't know how to drive here. I don't know why people in the parking lot, they, they, they drive through the parking spots instead of going around. 
I guess people don't know, I don't know, uh, codes? Street codes? I don't care, I don't know. Anyway, 40.5. 41 okay I'll stop here let me put you down here a second I'll stop this guy I'll, uh, I'll, I'll pump at 41 because uh, most likely it'll be 42 unfortunately it's not uh, Tesla doesn't immediately uh, immediately update the the uh, air pressure information there it takes a bit let me put you down here a second sorry oops okay this is uh this is a 36 wow it's pretty low which is not good So again, here, you see, rising. This sucks big time, and here, and then a bunch of here, and then on the window. I can try this one with the alcohol. Uh, I don't want to try alcohol on the, on the... How much is now? 37.5. Yeah, again, these people are, Dumbasses. You see, and here I had some resin here, and here, and here, and here, and some here and here. Okay, and it's all sticky. Ah, shoot. I have to go home and clean this because otherwise. I'll get it gets safe there forever. Okay, let me see how much is it. Thirty eight point five. Let's check out what's the percentage here. Is a 69 percent, 75 kilowatts uh, power, and it charged 25.5 kilowatts hour. Still good. I need, I think, I need another pump because this one is pretty slow. I use it for my bikes and stuff. So and. When it's low, it's, it's not powerful enough. Okay, let's check it out. For 39. And I noticed there is another here. Raising. This sucks. Yeah. I'll try with the alcohol here and see if we... Yep, it died. Ah, damn it. Ooh, burns. Okay. I have to charge this. Go home and charge it and then I'll do it later on. Uh, let me put it here. In the meantime... This one's ring case. They saved me many times. If you don't have it, uh, I made a video about it. This is a, a cover for your rings all the way. And they have it for Model Y performance too, 21 inches, so, so it's pretty good. So check it out to the video. So let me put this guys back. Let me close it here. And let's see how charging here is uh, 72%. 71 kilowatts still, pretty good. 28 kilowatt hour charged. Let me get inside so it's a bit chiller. Mm. 
let me check the tire pressure you see tire pressure is still uh, 39 psi 38 but i char i pump it some air so the the update is not that uh immediate let's check it out uh where is it i think it's in uh uh service i forgot let's try it yeah 39 yeah so it's not uh It's not immediate, so you pump some air, but the, the this information are it says uh, 20 minutes uh, ago. Maybe so. In, in uh, maybe by the time I'm done, uh, it will update this. Okay, so it should be 40, 40, and 39. We'll see how it goes. So right now I'm still at uh, uh, I'm at 74 percent charged. Charging at 68 kilowatts and I put in 90, so it will take me a well, while 20 minutes. It's okay. Uh, I can do uh, some uh, work anyway. I'll see you in a bit. So I'm done charging 95%. Uh, I charge 44 kilowatt hour, that's pretty good. Uh, actually, let me unlock the port. And that's it. Pretty good. So I'm ready for the trip tomorrow. I want to clean those uh, resin residue and then uh, put some more air in the tires. And everything is good. Please uh, subscribe to the channel, put a like, turn on notification and share it. And I'll see you on next video. Ciao to people.